Hello friends and how are you all doing today? The question says X and Y entered into a joint business where their capitals in the ratio 3 is to 2. At the end of 3 months, X took out one third of his capital but after another 3 months, Y put in a sum equal to what X had taken out. If at the end of the year Y gets 11,000 more than what X gets as profit, find the total profit in the business and the profit share of X in the business. So here, in order to solve this given problem, let us draw a table. Now, X capital is in the ratio, X and Y's capital is in the ratio 3 is to 2, right? So, X capital will be 3X for initial 3 months and then after 3 months, he reduced his capital by one third. So, that will be by X amount, that will be for the remaining period, that is 9 months. 12 months in a an year and after 3 months he reduced. So for 9 months he is having 3x minus x capital. So capital contribution for 1 month will be equal to 9x. And this will be 2x. 2x into 9 will be 18x. So in all it will be 27 X. Similarly, we will be doing it for Y's capital. It was 2X for the initial 6 months. After 6 months, he added the same amount. That means he added X, what, the, what X has taken out. He added the same for the next 6 months. So it will be 12X plus 3X into 6 will be equal to 18x, so in all it will be 30x, right? So we have the profit sharing ratio equal to 27x is to 30x, that is equal to 9 is to 10. Now, X share in profit will be 9 upon 19 into profit and Y's share in profit will be 10 upon 19 into profit and we are given that X, sorry, Y is getting 11,000 more. So that means 10p upon 19, we have taken profit as p here, minus 9p upon 19 is equal to 11,000. What we need to do further is we just need to solve it. So, this implies p upon 19 is equal to 11,000. That further implies that the profit is equal to 19 into 11,000, that is rupees 209000. So, for the first part, the answer that is the total profit in the business is rupees 209000. And the answer to the second part, that is Y's share, sorry, X share, in profit, that will be equal to 9 upon 19 into 209000. That is equal to rupees 99,000. Right. So these two are the required answer to the given question. Hope you understood it well. Do take care of your calculations and have a nice day ahead.